where I had my first date with my wife. Kind of dry. Can't taste the jalapenos at all. There's no heat to them. Hey Dylan, time for another burger review. We are at Art City Trolley here in Springville, Utah. And I'll tell you a little bit of a story about this in a second. But this has been here for quite a while. I talked to the general manager in here. It's been here for 27 years. And the story is this is actually where I had my first date with my wife. So my wife asked me out on a first, on, on, asked me out first. But she only got to me for like 45 seconds. I was right there. But anyway, so, you, so we decided to go out. We go here and then we go see uh, Remember the Titans, the, the movie with Denzel Washington. It's a great movie. Anyway, this is like 21 years ago. We've been married for 20 years. I know, divorce attorney that's been married for a long time. Super bullish on marriage. I am, by the way. But yeah, this is our first date. And I remember bringing her here. We get dinner. Uh, I think she got a sandwich and fries. And, and uh, I ate off her plate because I figured I was paying for the thing, so I might as well eat off the plate. So, all right, so we got a burger here. I had made my own. It's a cheeseburger with some caramelized onions, bacon, and then fried jalapenos on this thing. Big, sturdy bun. I can already feel that. Okay. Well, good memories here, but let's see if the burger is any good. Give some sweetness in there. I guarantee that's coming from the. Well, coming from the onions. If you're wondering why it's called Art City, so Springville, Utah is like a big art city, you know, museums all over the place, very big city for uh, Mormon art especially. So that's kind of what I call it. Now. And the trolley parts, they actually have a trolley up the front. So that bad boy is cooked. There's no medium in that thing. All right, so yeah, let's go through it. The bun is very sturdy, kind of dry. Uh, super white so kind of flavorless the beef is there not in a ton i like the caramelized onions they actually do those pretty well can't taste the jalapenos at all there's no heat to them there's a little bit of fruity taste in the jalapenos but that's about it and then you know bacon is okay Let me see what bacon is. yeah i can't really get the bacon very much either so you know it's all right Okay, that's gonna be like a six seven on the burger for me. So great memories here. Now the greatest burger. Uh, they do have onion rings, so let's give these things a try. Nope. Kind of tastes like came out of a bag. Okay. You can tell really really good onion rings from the Pretenders, and that's just kind of a Pretender right there. So that's like a that's like a five two on the onion rings. So. My best. The nice thing about this place though, is it has been around for a long time. And she was talking to me about what happened during COVID. Cause I asked her like, how'd you guys do? She said, they did okay. But the community really rallied around the restaurant, came out here, did a whole bunch of curbside pickups. So they were able to keep everybody on. So good for you, Springville, right? Like not the best burger, but this has been around for a long time. Their other food is good. I've, I've had it over the years. And uh, you know, good, good, good on you for taking care your people during COVID. So anyway, come on down, but that's my review. All right, I'm out.